There's three different tennis balls that we use in tennis today. The one on the left is a foam ball that is used on a 36-foot court and is for players that are 8 and under. Also, the court has a shorter net and the kids use shorter rackets. The ball in the middle is a transition ball and there's three stages of transition balls. There's a red transition ball with 25% the bounce of the hard ball. There's the orange transition ball pictured here that has 50% the bounce of a hard ball that is used on a 60-foot court. And there's a green transition ball that has 75% the bounce of a hard ball and is used on a full court or a 78-foot court. The ball on the right is a hard ball that is used for ages 11 and up. The transition balls are used for ages 10 and under. Now, the goal with these balls is to allow players to progress slowly up to the hard ball, allowing them, A, technically, to be able to hit the strokes with the same techniques that one might use in, let's say, uh, an advanced level. With the hard ball, it was hard for kids to hit with strokes that they might use later in life because the balls move so fast. The slower ball allows them uh, to use the techniques that they might progress to uh, in high school, but use at a much earlier age. Another great part of these transition balls is that tactically on the tennis court, kids are able to see situations happen and open up much more clearly instead of fighting just to get a ball to come back real fast since the ball travels slower, bounces a little bit lower, they are able to let's say open up the court, see the open court, and hit the ball to the open court because they have time to see that happen with a slower moving ball. We're really excited about this and we hope that you are too.